All right, welcome to Tidbit Tuesday. And I have my camera the right way, so I actually uh, need to make sure that I am looking good. So, um, so here I am, I waiting for people to get on. Um, you can see the products up here. These are the ones I'm going to be talking about today. And, okay, great. All right, so these are the ones I'm going to be talking about today. And uh, so just look at them a little bit, and I will go into detail about the immune system. So here is what I want to say about the immune system. The immune system is more than just does your child get sick or not? Or when they get sick, how long they're sick, okay? That, those are symptoms, but that does not describe what the immune system is. The immune system is how the body protects itself against all sorts of things. People, people just think it in terms of viruses. Do, do they get sick or not? Um, or do they get well faster with viruses and bacteria? It also could be other pathogens like yeast, um, yeast infections, mold, it could be um, other, other toxicity. For example, if your child eats a lot of processed foods or foods, foods high in sugar, then the immune system is weaker as the body processes that out of the system, okay? So we just want to keep that in mind that the immune system, it's a, it's a bigger picture of the overall health. In fact, when I do consulting with people, what I like to, to get a baseline on is how the immune system is functioning. Okay, and there are some gauges to tell, right? Um, for example, you know, how often um, does somebody um, get, you know, pick up a bug? You know, we pick up bugs all the time, right? Sometimes we, our bodies kick into fever mode and we flush those out, but sometimes if our immune system is so good, the viruses and bacteria that get into our system pass through the gut and uh, we're able to eliminate those out of the body without much effect. Now what happens is when those viruses, bacteria, whatever, when they get stuck in the gut, that is when the body kicks in the fever, gets that, th gets, gets the, you know, that immune response going because it's too big for just the regular system to, to handle, right? Okay, so that's a little bit um, about the immune system, okay? Now I'm going to talk just briefly, um, mind, body, spirit, okay? You can tell somebody's immune system not only by how they cope with sickness and how fast they recover, but also how, um, how well do they combat negativity. For example, if somebody is always just feeling down and depressed and anxious and um, hardly getting any respite from that, that could be a sign that the immune system, which is the body's defense, is not fully on guard. You know, it could be that, you know, negative, uh, negative vibrations, negative energy, you know, the fear or the panic from somebody stand, sitting next to them can really affect them. But if you think about it, when you're on top of the world, when you're feeling amazing, when you're so happy about something, you're not getting sick, right? Because you are feeling so good. Your systems are up to par, they're doing its thing. I remember when I first fell in love, I was getting no sleep and I was acing my classes and I was on a high all the time. My immune system was, I mean, obviously I should have gotten better sleep and taken better care of myself, but because of my, um, because I was so joyful, my immune system actually raised up to match that. Um, so with that, um, the immune system is more than just combating viruses and bacteria. It also measures how well our body is doing at setting boundaries against negative, you know, um, when you're around a negative person, do you carry that negative feeling with you when you're done talking to them? Or um, it, it's a lot like that. Do, are you, do you feel overwhelmed the entire week when somebody dumps their burden on you? Uh, that type of thing. So um, also the mind. Um, 
you know, and, and what I've talked about as far as emotionally um, also affects the mind too. So we're going to be talking here, you know, when the mind is crowded with negative thoughts, with, you know, the inability to eliminate things from the body, then the brain gets congested, right? We can't think clearly, we're scatterbrained, we reach our limit, something happens and it just breaks the camel's back, that type of thing mentally. Um, what I've noticed is when my digestive system is working properly, my brain works really, really well. My brain is a lot clearer. And also, I'm a lot, it's a lot easier for me to process emotions as they come. You know, betrayal or, you know, somebody offends you or how, how do you process those? Just last week, my immune system was not up to par and I was getting overwhelmed by every little thing and just, ah, oh, I want to give up, you know, um, doing this or that. I just want to crawl in a hole. When you feel like that, your immune system is not doing very well. Um, and my gut wasn't either. I had not been taking my probiotics for probably about a week just because you have to take them with food and I kept forgetting when I had eaten and then I'm going to bed and realizing, you know, I don't want to eat at 10 o'clock at night. So, you know, that I excuses, right? So I hadn't been doing my probiotics. I've been doing my vitamins, but not my probiotics. And the probiotics really help with the systems of elimination. So what was happening is my gut was building up, um, you know, not only toxins, sugar, whatever I was eating in my body that wasn't super healthy and I wasn't eating enough greens, but also my body was not able to process the emotions as they were coming. So I had um, a wave of, of bad news hit me and it really got me down. And I was even surprised because usually things like that, you know, I'm like, oh, I'm kind of disappointed, but it usually doesn't get me down and make me feel depressed, but it was. And it took me about 24 hours to realize it was because my gut wasn't healthy. So my, you know, in the process of getting rid of this, you know, these toxins that have been building up in my gut with my probiotics, um, the emotions weren't able to process as well. The, the body and the mind, the spirit, they all work together. My brain was cloudy, my gut wasn't healthy, I was feeling bloated, I you know, couldn't process those emotions as well as actually eliminate them. My, my bowels were full, you know, and I just could, wasn't eliminating, right? Fancy way of saying I was a little bit constipated, right? So, um, so the, if, if that resonates with you, um, let's focus on the immune system, okay? And I'm gonna focus on the children's immune system because I've talked about the doTERRA vitamins, the PB Assist, the Terrazyme, those things are amazing. But as far as kids go, I really wanna talk about that. So thank you so much for watching this. Um, let's jump right in. I'm gonna have my daughter, Charity, she's gonna pick these things up one at a time and um, we're actually gonna use them on her. Um, a lot of these things, the supplements, um, non-oil supplements that your child can take internally and, and we'll show you how it's done. And I'm, I'm gonna ask my daughter to describe, you know, her experience. So do you want to pick one? One of these, which one are you gonna pick first? The fish oil? Do you like the fish oil? Uh, what do you like about the fish oil? It's yummy. It's yummy? It's got an orange, um, it's got a, a wild orange in it. It's called IQ Mega. This is a fish oil supplement. Um, it's got great um, omega-3s, which is great for the mind, the eyesight, um, inflammation in the body, that type of thing. Uh, so it has fish oil from cod, save, and haddock, and then it has DHA, and it has EPA, and, the, and it has total omega-3s, um, 1,550 milligrams. So really, really good. All right, so, um, so what I'm going to do, so I'm just going to read what it says on the side. <clears throat> Take one teaspoon daily. Uh, store in um, refrigerator. I took this out of the refrigerator. Um, and then it, the description is <clears throat> that it has wild orange, peel, rosemary, which is also great for the mind, uh, mixed tocopherols from the sunflower seed and sunflower uh, and lectin. And uh, it says to that um, doTERRA IQ Mega takes the fishy taste out of fish oil with the fresh orange flavor of doTERRA wild orange essential oil. This great tasting and easy to swallow omega-3 supplement provides 1300 milligrams of DHA and EPA per serving to support healthy brain, cardiovascular, that's the heart, the immune system and joint function. IQ Mega is formulated to be used daily with the doTERRA A to Z chewable, which is right here. 
All right, so I'm going to go ahead and give her a, a teaspoon of it. Sometimes I'm lazy and just dump the equivalent in my child's mouth like this. Um, I love it too. I need it. Um, and when I do this, uh, my baby who's nursing also gets the benefits and I totally see um, her brain health improve and also mine. Less brain fog and cloudiness. Okay. When, what are you going to pick next? The reason she's sniffling is I have Breathe in the diffuser right there, and I just put it on right before this video. So Breathe really, you know, breaks up mucus and stuff in the body, so it clears out the sinuses. All right, so this is the doTERRA Kids Probiotic. And this was actually an answer to prayer a couple of years ago when I went to convention. I was hoping, okay, more than anything, there are a few products I was really hoping for. Um, it does have... It does have something that you're supposed to be able to tear it tear it open, and maybe it does. Um, sometimes I have trouble finding it, so I just uh, snip it, snip the top. Okay, so basically it's like a pixie stick, okay? And um, do you want to stand up and do it so that, or at least kneel up, so the people in the video can see? So you just take it, take it like a pixie stick. It's super easy, and uh, so PBS is junior, yep, all gone is a powdered probiotic supplement designed for children who, and, or adults who have trouble swallowing uh, pills. It includes five billion live cells of unique blend of six different probiotic strains specifically selected for their benefits among children. These probiotics have been a cap, encapsulated to ensure to, they reach the intestines, which is super key um, in terms of a probiotic, um, to reach the intestines safely and are blended into a delicious powder that can be poured directly into the mouth for a fun and tasty way to integrate probiotics into everyone's daily routine. Um, do you know what flavor this is? Watermelon? It's watermelon flavor. It's, it's tart just like, a, just like a pixie stick. It's watermelon flavor. Um, I, I really love the probiotic. Um, when, so I said this was an answer to prayer when it came out. I, I really wanted a probiotic for kids because I loved how the PBS system worked for me. And I, I was like, how can I give this to a kid? What I was doing is snipping the, the, pre the prebiotic capsule off and just breaking open the green one and putting it in, but then it's not encapsulated so it doesn't reach you know, the lower gut. And so I was wondering, um, doTERRA announced it, you know, it was an answer to prayer. And um, my children, especially this one, she has always had a low immune system. She's my very first daughter. You know, didn't know what I was doing <laughs> raising her. Um, and I did a lot of things wrong. Her immune system was very compromised. And so when this probiotic came out, I got it right away. I didn't even leave the convention before I had it in my hands. And I went home and I started using it on my daughter. In fact, all my girls. And the, the results were amazing. They started going more regularly. They started to tolerate more foods that they had trouble with. Um, and the biggest difference is since giving this to my children, we have not had a massive outbreak of sickness in our family. Um, we have had every once in a while, we'll have a fever that lasts a few hours, or you know, a cough here and there, or somebody will you know have a stomach bug and they'll spike a fever for a few minutes, throw up, and then that, that's the end. It's really quick, the immune system is amazing. And we used to be down and out for weeks, um, sometimes months out of the year. So this has really made a huge difference. And like I was talking about before, that lower gut health is really, you just wanna be able to eliminate the toxins, the emotional toxins, the mental toxins out. And if your gut is constipated, your, your spiritual um, system can't flush that out either. So um, anyway, so I love, love the probiotics. My girls love it. It's like a treat for them. Okay, pick the next one. Okay, On Guard Beadlets. Now, for these, my children, I've, I've raised them on these. This is one or two drops of On Guard, just a drop of On Guard in a little bead form. Okay, let me, um, it's tiny, tiny, tiny. Okay, so I'm gonna try to, oh, it's super tiny. So very small there, and um, yeah, to get, so, so she'll take it. Uh, do you break it in your mouth or do you just swallow it? Swallow it. She just swallows it. My other kids will break it in their mouth, and then if it's a little too spicy because it's straight on guard, 
chase it down with some water. But it's kind of like a burst of flavor. It's kind of like a fruit snack burst of flavor for my girls. It's fun. You know, as long as you introduce it as this is a fun way to take care of your health, they respond well. So, um, so we really like that. It gives you that daily dose of On Guard, which On Guard is the protective blend. When, when I use On Guard, I eliminate from my system very easily. Um, when my girls use it, they're a lot better. They actually treat each other better. I think it's just because it puts their body on guard to the susceptibility of negative energy around them. So they're not fighting as often throwing tantrums. It still happens, but not as often. So I really love this. Um, pick the next one. The vitamin. Okay, so this is doTERRA A to Z Chewable. It comes in the kids kit alongside the fish oil. And uh, it's watermelon flavored. There are a bunch of vitamins in here. So, um, you know, if most humans don't get the, vi most adults don't get the vitamins we need, most kids don't either, right? Because sometimes we, um, we don't treat ourselves good because we're not treating our kids good with vitamins or vice versa. So um, vitamins really, um, do you like the taste of it? Yeah. So it's, it's, you know, you have to bite it, you know, you have to chomp on it, you know, or you can just suck on it for a while. Usually she sucks on it for a while and then bites it. But, um, you know, I like that it gives my children a good foundational health. And if you have not um, looked into the quality of doTERRA vitamins, they are off the charts. High quality. I'm not going to go a whole lot into that. You can ask me questions specifically. I can send you information. Very high quality vitamins. I would not give my kids anything else. I have not found anything else that remotely compares to the quality or the results I've seen with my children. So I love it across the board. So these hand in hand plus a probiotic. Um, these I do try to do every day with my children. This one. I forget a few days here and there, but I try to as I remember. But if my children ever have an upset stomach or I, I feel like their immune system is dropping, like they start getting sniffles or, you know, that type of thing, I, I pump out the, uh, the probiotics and also give them one or sometimes two um, on guard beadlets. And, you know, and you can give these two, okay, so the serving size is one satchel, um, one sachet, there are 30 in a box. And, uh, so you should take one daily, but sometimes I forget. So sometimes what I'll do is I'll, you know, if a, if a sickness, if we're kind of on the verge right there, or, or what is raging in our bodies, I, I try to give one a day until, until they get really back to health, and then sometimes I'll forget again, right? That's just how we are as moms. Okay, pick the next one. Balance. Okay, <laughs> balance is phenomenal on a daily basis. It has frankincense in it, which is amazing. It's got oils that help pull you to the earth, help you feel safe and grounded. It's a great way to start off the day. It's already diluted. Um, balance is one of the oils that is pre-diluted, so you don't even have to worry about diluting it for kids. It's awesome. Um, so I'm just going to rub it on, on the bottoms of our feet. Um, it really helps children feel grounded, supported, that type of thing. So I really love um, using balance on my kids feet. And plus they smell good. <laughs> right? Um, so yeah, so they get that grounding. Um, it also helps with the mind, just feeling safe, supported, grounded, a great way to start off the day and end the day, right? Um, Dr. Hill, the Dr. David Hill, the uh, chief medical officer of doTERRA, recommends adults, children, do put some on their feet morning and night just to start the day grounded, present, and the day that way. It really helps with sleep. It helps with just managing emotions. just helps with the overall system staying balanced, which is why it's called balance, right? Okay, pick the next one. On guard. Okay, so I do want to say with On Guard, um, doTERRA has a bunch of the doTERRA touch rollers that are pre-diluted. This is amazing for kids. Get the whole kit if you can. Uh, these touch rollers are amazing, lifesavers. You just roll them on your kid's feet, rub it in. You don't have to worry about mixing or diluting. Um, my uh, On Guard one went missing and I haven't been able to find it, which is why I have this one. Otherwise, I would have just had the On Guard roller here. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to um, put a drop in my hand, you know, uh, for kids. One drop is fine. And I'm going to pre-dilute it because I don't have the roller. Um, 
And even for kids, sometimes I don't dilute it. I'll just put the drop on. But just to get it evenly across both feet to get, get a good amount. This is going to, and you can put it on the feet, just a drop on the feet and do the on guard beadlets internally um, to really get the immune system supported. In fact, before we go out and about to a place where I know that they usually pick up viruses from, church, um, big stores, um, I usually give them an on guard beadlet before we go or put on guard in their hands and make, it, make them rub it together. So, um, Plus, kids love the massage, loves the, the bonding experience that comes from getting these. So it's really a good way to connect with your children, help them feel loved, supported, knowing that they're cared for. Um, it's, it's wonderful. It's a beautiful experience. So there we go. There we have On Guard. Okay, pick the next one. Oh, oregano. Okay, if you do not have the touch oregano, it is my favorite touch roller. Why? Because the oregano is very hot oil and I hate um, diluting an oil. You know, I don't use it as much when I have to dilute it. And so the touch roller is amazing. Um, oregano is amazing, amazing, amazing for the gastrointestinal tract. Okay. And that's usually where our blockages are. So what you can do is you can actually rub it on the tummy. Okay. And it's pre-diluted, right? Or you can even and the lower part of the tentacle, <laughs> we have our bonding moment, right? So putting a oregano on the feet, the lower part of the feet, um, this is where the digestive um, organs, the organs of elimination are, right here on the bottom half of the foot. So um, so rubbing it here, I, I love the oregano to touch. It's, it's kind of odd. Some people are like, like oregano is the last one I have for my original kit. I don't know how to use it. Oregano is one of the best oils you can possibly use for the immune system because it helps create an open, clean track for viruses and bacteria to just get flushed out and, and other pathogens. Um, oregano by nature, the herb itself, um, helps the body weed off viruses, bacteria, yeast, mold, fungus, all that from the body. And so it's a great way to get the, the, get the gastrointestinal system prepped and um, Fleshed out, ready, ready to roll. So I love oregano touch. Next one. Breathe. Where do we put breathe? Yep, on the neck. Yep, right on the the respiratory area. Sometimes on the chest too. Um, breathe emotionally helps with sadness and grief. Um, sometimes kids start coughing and they're a little bit sad. Um, their lungs start getting weak when they're um, really sad, and then you know they can be susceptible to colds and flus. Um, you know, usually when we're happy, we don't get sick as much, right? It's more sad that we get sick a lot. So breathe is amazing because it helps focus on eliminating that grief from our bodies as well as helping purify, you know, help our respiratory system be, you know, clear and all that. So it really just, I mean, it helps with different grief and all that. So I love, love, love the support that breathe gives. All right, next one. Frankincense. Where do you like frankincense? On your tummy? <laughs> yeah, frankincense is good for the tummy. It's really good for anywhere, the spine, um, the back of the neck to help with focus, um, that type of thing. There is a, a blend called Intune that's great for focus too. Um, I find though that if I'm doing these, um, these things specifically and, and the beadlets and the balance, that I don't need a whole lot of other things. So, um, but frankincense is really amazing. It helps with the immune system. It's powerful at helping the cellular health. So it, it helps the immune system down at the level of the cell. And it's beautiful how frankincense just goes in and it helps create a new environment for healthy cells to thrive and uh, toxic cells to be removed from the body. So it's really powerful for the immune system. Is that it? Oh, there's one more. Yeah, digestin. Okay. Now, why digestin for the immune system? Because the gut is actually the center of our immune system. Okay. It's, our gut is referred to as our second brain, right? It's where our, our, when we think of things that are, you know, emotions can get trapped there. And then, you know, because we're not eliminating it, then we're feeling the repercussions. Because, I mean, the emotions, emotions want to be processed. 
says, and the body, but sometimes it can't because our digestive system, which is where our immune system is stored, are located, is, you know, backed up. So digestive can definitely help bring energy to the body um, because it can help flush, flush things out, give the body that extra support to eliminate things from the digestive system. Let's put some on your tummy. Okay, and a great thing is if your child has issues with um, acid reflux or, or that type of thing, um, you can also put a little bit in, in the belly button too to help calm that and support occasional uh, digestive upset there. So um, I love that, I love that. So you have, these are the, the top tools for a child's immune system. And it's great when you really make it a priority. It helps us stay present, it helps us bond, it helps us stay well so we can do fun things together. It just creates such a beautiful, beautiful family dynamic. So um, the immune system is powerful um, when, when it's functioning right. It can really fight off a whole lot. Um, so in, in closing, I just want to say thank you for watching this video and hopefully I've inspired you somewhat, um, you know, as far as, you know, if your child is struggling mentally or digestively, the immune system is a really great place to start because it helps fortify the body against the negativity that we all want to avoid, um, helps flush things out of the body that don't serve us. It really is tied to our overall health and function. So. Anyways, thank you so much. Let me know if you have any other questions or questions about these. You can also Google search um, any of these, but of course, buy your products from doTERRA itself because buying them online, you can get cheap shot and get something that's not what it says it is. Um, so anyways, th uh, just so you know, have a great day. Happy Tidbit Tuesday. Pass along this video if you feel like it would help somebody. Thanks.